Hey everyone. The first ice creams were invented in Persia in or around 550 BC. That's during the late Bronze Age and in modern day Iran, Iraq, Kuwait, Syria and Turkey. The concoction proved popular and it traveled around the globe and down the centuries. Today, ice cream is a 73.6 billion dollar industry and that is just an approximate number. Today, let's know about the history and invention of the incredible ice cream. Let's start the video, but before that, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like this video. The Persian people constructed ice houses and ice pits along the route of the Euphrates River and these were filled with snow that fell during sub-zero winters. Their ice creams, sorbets and falooda remain cold in the oppressive summer conditions. Ice cream was always consumed within hours of its creation. Did you know that the English word sherbet comes from the Turkish term for sweetened drinks chilled by snow? In the 13th century, there was a wonderful scientific discovery. When ice and salt were combined, the two substances created an exothermic reaction, the release of heat as the molecules moved. The salt lowered the freezing point of the milk or cream below the freezing temperature of water. The ice pulled the heat away from the liquid and the movement of the molecules in the liquid created air. ice crystals attached to the milk or cream fats to become a foam more air resulted in smoother ice cream today's ice creams are classed as emulsions all ice creams have an exothermic brine a chosen liquid and a flavoring the 15th century mughal emperors were the first to enjoy kulfi this was a dessert a little denser than ice cream created by freezing milk in molds In China, an iced buffalo milk and camphor dessert was popular. There's a legend but no proof that the explorer and merchant Marco Polo discovered ice cream in China in the late 13th or early 14th century and that he introduced it to Europe. Another unproven claim courtesy of the Victorians involved Catherine de Medici. It was said that she took ice cream from her native Florence to Paris when she married the future king Henry II of France in 1633. There's no evidence that around the same time King Charles I in England ate ice cream during his reign. During the 1600s, Italian pharmacists utilized the ice cream salt and water chemical reaction as a party trick to impress their customers. A resident of Naples took it a step further and he made a tasty offering in the 1660s. Antiquary and politician Elias Ashmole recorded that Britain's King Charles II dined on strawberries and one bowl of ice cream at a banquet at Windsor Castle in 1671. The ice cream was only consumed at the top table. The Europeans took ice cream to the Americas. Thomas Jefferson, minister to France prior to becoming president of the USA, favored the French style ice cream that he had enjoyed in Paris. French chefs used egg yolks to create a custard base for the ice cream. In the Victorian era, the uptake of the mechanical ice cream makers, normally a metal drum in a wooden tub with a handle that turned and mixed the concoction, increased. The USA and Canada received demands for more and more ice from the ice cream loving Europeans. Ice cream cups were first patented in the USA during the 1880s and the ice cream sundae was invented in the Midwest in 1881. Although the inventor's identity soon became a matter of dispute. The waffle cone was first presented with ice cream at the 1904 St. Louis World Fair. and during prohibition in the USA the lack of refreshing drinks led to a surge in ice cream consumption vanilla chocolate and strawberry are the top 3 flavors mint chocolate chip and salted caramel are in the 4th and 5th place there are over 1000 ice cream flavors in the world National Ice Cream Day and World Ice Cream Day occur each July on the 3rd Sunday of the month. So, don't forget to make a note in your diary. Well, 
that's it for today i hope you're liking nerdy's discoveries can't wait for the next video to learn more and be fascinated about see you on the next bye